Hi, welcome to this new video tutorial. Today I'm going to give you one of the solutions uh, for solving uh, this error on cock reference error. Global is not defined. So usually then uh, you have this error here in Angular. This uh, solution here is based on Angular 15 plus, as we know, like since uh, Angular 15 here, um, the poly um, field.ts file is no longer included in the projects by default. So we have to create that manually. So then uh, in here, if you can see here from my browser here, I try to run this applications that I'm building here, but get caught into this error here. So here's that error. If I go here to the console, we can see that uh, we are caught with this error. So how to solve it? Here is one of the way around. So the first thing that we'll have to do here will be to stop our front end. Right, we stop our front end, then we need to install a couple of packages. And uh, yeah, we start by installing uh, the global and process package. Here is what we do here. Uh, so those have been installed. Now we need to go to the package.json. Uh, we come here and then we add this one here. I will also try to put some of these commands here in the descriptions for you. So we add the browser here with global, we specify the package here and the process. And this one is done. This one is done. And then, okay, the next thing that we have to do is to set, uh, to create the polyfill. And uh, so we have to create the polyfill in the root directory here. Yeah. So new file, we'll call it polyfills.ts. Here is that one here. And uh, inside that file here, you are going to set define the global variables here. So here is the one here that we set. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, and uh, as we know, once uh, we add a new file in, we add a new file in Angular, you also need to add this one, specify that one in the gconfig.ap JSON here. So we need to come also here and specify the file locations because the second one in the array, you have to put comma and yeah, we set that one here. Then once that one is done and uh, we can also come here in Angular Angular here inside polyfills here. I also set these locations. Right, this one is set. And uh, what have we uh, forgotten again? Okay, let's us try to build applications and see what happened. Mm -hmm. And Okay. It's running. 
Bam, you can see that here. Congratulations, our application is running now. Our chat room is running. It's okay now. So you can see everything yeah, is running. So that is it. That's one of the solutions. That's one way of solving this uh, global issue in Angular. I hope that this one will be useful to you. And then, yeah, stay tuned for the next tutorial. I will also put uh, some of this uh, comment that I use in this tutorial here in the, in the descriptions. Stay tuned. Bye.